Howdy everyone, UFO Bolt, <laughs> take two. Off to a rocky start, what, Stark? I can't even talk today. I, I'm, I'm slurring my words and I'm mumbling and, but that's not gonna stop me from doing today's live stream because I got something really special to show you today. That is a blimp hanger. That's what we're gonna talk about today. This is one of two blimp hangers that were built in 1942 here in Orange County, California. It was used by the Navy and the Marines for their LTA operations. That stands for lighter than air. Oh, and so you know, or give you some reference where we're at, this is in the heart of now a shopping complex and hot rod cars going by. Woo, there they go. This was formerly part of the Naval Air Station, Santa Ana, that's what it was the original name. Then it became the Marine Air Corps Station. There were two uh, hangars at one time, but on November 7th, 2003, one of the two hangars burned down. And I'll show you footage of the burned out facility uh, in a little bit. The hangars were 1,072 feet long. That's uh, 327 meters and 292 feet, uh, which is 89 meters uh, wide, and then 192 feet tall, that's 59 meters. That's 17 stories high. Can you imagine that? These were, uh, as I said, built in 1942 uh, using Oregon uh, Douglas fir. And the, uh, the facility was in operation until uh, 1999 when it was finally shut down permanently. Now, it really was decommissioned at least once before, and that was in 1949. But it was recommissioned in 1951 for the Korean War. It then became the country's first facility for helicopter training. In fact, in 1966, it became the Marine Corps Air Station, Santa Ana. And during the Vietnam War, it was used for testing radar systems and training helicopter pilots. Unfortunately, as I said, hangar number one was burned down November 7th, 2023. I mean, what, that's uh, not even a year ago. Personally, uh, I have my suspicions that it was not an accident. I can't prove it, but this is prime real estate now. This is in the heart of Orange County where development is still exploding. As you can see, this is on, it's on a very busy street. We're coming up to the corner of uh, Warner and I believe it is um, Edinger. I'll, I'll confirm that for you in a second here. So right there where uh, that green fencing is, that's uh, more condos being erected over there. Pack and stack. Uh, that's what's happening here in Orange County, sadly. So as I said, this is prime real estate now. Uh, you know, look at there, there's, there's Costco, okay? If Costco's in the neighborhood, it's prime real estate. And they've been here for a while now. When I was a child, this was bean fields all around for miles and miles and miles. And I remember as a child watching the, uh, and now we're talking about the, the 60s and the, the 70s, watching the helicopters fly over our houses and around this area as they did their training missions. I love this. Look how, how massive that is. That was big enough you could fly an aircraft through it, a small aircraft, mind you. You can't put a Boeing 747, but you could fly a Piper through it or some other craft. In fact, like I said, I mean, they, what they did is they housed um, blimps in there because that's what it was primarily used for. So. What I'm gonna do is I'm trying to find a, a, a spot where I can, I'll just sit down here on the ground, and point it up and I'll step behind, step behind the, the post here. You'll, you may hear the uh, uh, signal beeping in the background, but say la vie. Again, that's 17 story tall. I mean, I, I can't even fathom that. I mean, it's, it's huge and I'm like, I'm across the street from it. You know, that's a, that's a eight lane highway we're looking at. 
And as I said, it was 192 feet tall, 59 meters, amazing. Now, in the 1970s, in 1975, they used this hangar for uh, a film called The Hindenburg. Now, The Hindenburg starred George C. Scott, and it was the story of the Hindenburg crossing from Germany to uh, the United States, the East Coast, and how it, when it was landing, it burst into flames. And that story uh, posits that it was a... Uh, an inside job that was a, a sabotage, but you know, come on, Hollywood is not known for telling the truth. So if you see it, don't believe anything you see other than it's fun to watch. Okay, so now, again, give you a sense of scale. I personally don't like heights, so I don't know if I could walk up there. I would do it <laughs> to get a shot. <laughs> That's the one thing I would do. And as you can see, it's no public access. This is the remains of hangar number one. Those were the four pillars, and then on, also that red and white tower, checkered tower, that was the control tower for the blimps and later for the helicopters. All right. So there you go, guys. That's our adventure here at uh, the former Tustin Lighter Than the Air Base. Thank you all for watching. Oh, of course, you know, I've got to say it. If you enjoyed this video, would you subscribe? Would you give me a thumbs up? Would you, you know, leave a comment if you're watching this in uh, replay? And uh, I do live streaming, I do content creation, uh, cooking, travel, and so on and so forth. And so I am gonna sign off now and we'll see you guys next time. Take care, bye-bye.